What is up, you beautiful people, and welcome back to the Raid Boss Equality Brawl. We are playing some Borzoon today because uh, Inflames has shown us the way. Um, and we're also joined here by Sergeant Sprinkles, as well as, I think it's Diamond Soul. I don't actually remember um, what the in-game name is. Yeah, it's Diamond Soul. Okay, there we go. Um, let's go. So, Brawl Modifiers. Units have... Um, what is it? The Armored Status? No Armored Status. There's, there's no Armored Status. There's, there's no nothing. Um... You can also summon a, a raid boss every four minutes, stacks onto your side of the field. And uh, there's the hallowed staging area, as you guys saw back there, which allows us to... Uh, ooh, that is a poor choice this week. Um, there'd be, maybe it might be good against Warzone. But yeah, the hallowed staging area just gives us some buffs and stuff. So without the, the armor tags and stuff, and the stalkers are a lot less vulnerable. But Tychus is also vulnerable to all sorts of CC. But Tychus is probably the answer. Um, to the stalker question actually because he does so much damage he's just gonna rip through our stalkers oh my god wait unless unless we send some centurions into him first oh, what color is this guy he's yellow okay that's it he can be stunned you know they can be beaten they can be killed um stalker weapon let's, let's make it red Turn them into Forge Stalkers. There we go. We'll get some Taldarim Stalkers here. Are there Purifier Stalkers? Oh, there are Purifier Stalkers. That's cool. Oh, we're against a Dahaka. That is going to be a pain and a half. Uh, I mean, Dahaka can't eat Heroic Units still. Um, so there's that. There we go. I think this thing is still considered Armored. So the Stalkers are still good against buildings. Um, oh my god. Look at that damage output. He's too strong. All right, whatever. It's fine. We're just going to keep slamming down stalkers. We should be fine. Uh, when he's all invisible, he can't do anything. There we go. There we go. Juggle that aggro. Let's go, boys. Um, Trom. Trauma. Anyways. Mm, I don't actually know what you're supposed to do a Stepman this week. Cause nothing's nothing's mechanical either. So like all your bonus against mechanicals kind of like goes down the drain. Um, we got some ravisaurs here. That is a potentially interesting option to be explored. Let's get weapon upgrades and let's go to the next tier. Should probably get like armor and other stuff to upgrade too. I'll be honest. Sergeant Sprinkles here with the Nova coming in. Bam 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 bam. I'm basically playing Alarak. These are like slayers. Totally slayers. There we go. Those guys are dead. A huge Nux Storm. Well, he threw the grenade, and then I just blinked out of the Nux Storm. So, congratulations. You played yourself. Nux is probably one of the worst options here, I'll be honest. Probably Boswell or Sam would be better. Uh, maybe Boswell, I'll be honest. Uh, they blink out of the stun. There we go. There we go, boys. Get them, Stalkers. Show them. I think his idea was just like, we're just going to grab him into the storm. Um, and then so they would take extra storm damage. But yeah, Stalkers are downright oppressive this week. I would have never guessed, actually. Um, damn. They are so aggressively oppressive. They're like, because they're just a ranged unit that that heals. That is, has a decent health pool, so it doesn't get one shot for the most part. There's like an Impaler somewhere. But like, um, actually, that might be a problem. No, that, that Impaler might be a problem, actually. Um, we'll have to see here. Uh, my scan is out. My scan is out. Ooh! Okay, one stalker went down there. I guess Nux is here for the detection as well. Um, there we go. Hmm. I don't think the game's decided just yet. It looks kind of decided, but I don't think so. Um, I'm gonna put these guys back here. Just gonna try and get, get as much of the units here as possible on the sides first. There we go. Boom, boom, boom. Uh, definitely need some more detection. The Zerglings definitely seem to give our Stalkers a run for their money. Uh, DT. DT could be good. Fill in the gaps here. Do some slash damage. There we go. The Haka is just getting DPS down so hard by everything here. Uh, we got two black holes coming in, so... Uh, very terrifying. Marine's gonna come in here, just do just do a lot of damage. Okay, Psystorm. He has Kev, but Kev doesn't do bonus damage to me. 
anymore at least. Okay, so we're just going to have that black hole come in there. Um, that's basically just a bunch of units who didn't do anything. Um, they just all just got CC'd and blasted down. There we go. Kev's going to get locked, knocked down as well. I think... I don't, I don't know if Kev with hammer munitions can still counter us. That's the thing. Um, should we just go for the black hole right now? I want to drop the black hole when I see... When I see um, what is it? The raid bosses. I'm not dropping black hole unless I see raid boss. And if there's no raid boss, then... Uh, well... That, that, I'm fine with that too. Um, there we go. I'm gonna drop a black hole here to disable our opponents. Um, that'll let us get some damage on the base, hopefully. There we go. No raid bosses being pulled out here. Damn. It is what it is. Stalkers are actually really hard to deal with this week. What the heck? I did not expect this. Um, wow. I killed a lot of mineral value here, although Inflame's got a higher unit kill count, maybe because it's just the Tychus rotation. Damn, that was fast as well. Let's go for another round. Alright, what is up? We are back, and I just realized this is the same video because it's been so long since I've been doing double videos that I'm just so used to saying all right now to start up the next video. Anyways, we're back here. We're going to stand down some more stockers. Let's go. Uh, same repeat here. What's in Flames going on? Flames got that Dahaka. We got Zagara. Okay, okay. So I will bring the Stalkers only. So this will be a little more interesting. Um, but yeah, I feel like a pure Stalker Stacker team might only be beatable by like, maybe like, uh, Swan Thors or something like that. Right? Swan Thors and tanks. Like, it's a lot. It's a lot to deal with. It sounds like there's a Dahaka. Probably ours. Um, and let's see. We got, we got a Rainer Bunker. And we got somebody's with Sprog. Oh, jeez. I'm actually not sure how Reyna's going to deal with this. Hmm. Very interesting. Well, I don't want Tier 2 just yet. I'm just going to stick on the Tier 1. Reyna might get Banshees, though, so I probably do want Tier 2, actually. Let's go for that. Let's get that Tier 2. Um, oh, my Corsairs are going to literally be Tickle Cannons. Oh, that's good. I don't want to. I don't even want to think about that. Corsairs just tickling the Banshees for 3 damage because Corsairs don't have bonus to light anymore. Oh, uh, Zerglings are also going to really smash me up. Mm. Well, Cigar versus Kerrigan. Cigar Zerglings are a little weaker. So, it be like that. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. Oh yeah, also we like, I like, uh, went to play a game of Risk with the, with the boys yesterday. And like, we finally managed to finish a Risk game. Oh my goodness. <gasps> Can I beat these things? I might not be able to. They're actually too tanky. Hold on, wait, but I'm too tanky. But they also they are also kind of tanky. No, I think I'm tanky. But yeah, anyways, like uh So I like only recently joined these guys to play Risk, but like basically they've been playing since like ninth grade. And they have actually historically never finished a, a Risk game, so I was just like, damn. Historic moment. Um a Risk game was finished. Uh, with like an absolute brutal crushing victory um, by one of the one of my boys, um, but yeah, I don't know. I've actually like never. That was probably like my second game of Risk, and you know, I didn't get like wiped on the first. Uh, I wasn't the first person wiped out, so you know what? At least there was that going. Um, but I think I I really <laughs> I really overextended myself. I think I think with Risk, it's like it seems like a you don't really want to go on an all-out attack offensive because you just grind yourself down. I did that like once or twice, I think. I had a really strong position and then I got RNG'd into the ground and I was just like, feels bad, man. Anyways, is Reyna's wave going to be strong enough to beat mine? Uh, he's got a lot of AoE. Um, ooh, it's, it's looking like it's going to grind itself down. It's going to grind itself down, actually. But we have to like slowly retreat. So it's not like the most optimal. These are Stukov Banshees, right? Yeah, Infested Banshees. Oh my god, leg. Giga leg. Uh oh. I also just scanned. Uh, maybe. I'm actually get an Oracle here. She can detect stuff. And maybe also attack things if I want, it, want her to. Um, probably have her as support right now. I'm just wondering if I should get some uh, DTs. But DTs seem like a short-term fix to a long-term salute, long-term problem with the Rainer Bile. Because DTs will still take AoE damage um, from the Rainer Bile units. Queens are actually absolutely useless this week because they heal Bile units only. There are no Bile units this game. 
thanks to no tanks. Um, so there's that. I put that like a stasis ward. Yeah, I don't think I don't think Rainer Bow beats this normally, anyways. And um, this is like stalker stacker on. Oh no, she committed suicide. Classic Oracle. Okay. Ah, lag. What is this lag? Okay, anyways. You seek Stop attacking things. Thank you, Oracle. Um, just, just stop. There we go. Boom. You guys are wondering why I'm placing them inside the center aura first and then on the edge of the aura is that wherever you placed it last, it will keep that aura provided it is still like mostly within this area. So if it's half and half, like halfway in here, halfway in there, it'll keep the center aura, which is where I placed it in first and then the next thing. Oh my goodness. These banshees. These banshees, boys. These banshees. I don't think I have a good answer to them. Um, I actually don't think I have a good answer to them. Um, I'm going to need so many Corsairs before they do anything. Uh, Rainer Bow looks like it's actually just going to power through with those Marines. I don't know if I can do anything with Marines. Like, against them, that is. Mm. Oh, that was a huge blast there, though. Um... Let's just grab these guys forward here. A little defensive blast. Um, it's looking like we're going to need to call, call in some Corsairs, I think. Uh, there we go. If anything, just for the disruption web. Uh, but I do need them for the anti-air. Oh, it's going to feel so bad because they, they, they're only going to do 6 damage. Oh, no. What a disaster. Okay, you know what? It's fine. We'll just have to live with it. Uh, also, this is not the wave with them, so... Hmm. Well, Corsairs, maybe the stasis web will cause parts of the enemy wave to just run forward and do nothing. Um, which is good, I guess. Uh, Rainer's units only have so much health anyways. I should probably level up the damage my guys have. Oh my god, Corsairs automatically targeting the Overseer here. At least they're going through it decently quickly. Um, come on, melt those Banshees with your AoE attacks. Oh my goodness. Ah, the lag! How could this be? I literally have 8,000 ping right now. This, this is big meme. Um, slam this guy down here. There we go. Corsairs, the three Corsairs are kind of helpful. Uh, Come on, another disruption web? Maybe I should have put them in the center. Ooh, we got some tanks coming in. I think that is the answer to our stalkers. Tanks. Uh, the range is going to be quite helpful. We have some enemy raid bosses coming down. Uh, maybe we can just uh, get them to disruption web, like stasis web them. And they'll walk forward. I don't know. Uh, my Corsairs are very vulnerable to the infested... Uh, the Liberators. Uh, oh my goodness. This guy just left. Wait, that's the Stukov guy. Stukov just gave up. Um, well, that means we don't have aerial threats to worry about, but we do have lots of ground threats to worry about now. Um, probably more Stalkers is not going to fix it. Probably need to fix it with some Dark Templar, actually. But uh, we're going to die on this hill for a little bit, and we'll see what happens. Um... Oh my goodness. Rainer Bile still trying to plow through here. Those Marines getting meltated. I mean, the AoE on the... I think, honestly, the Firebat AoE is respectable. It's respectably dangerous. Um, Oracle's going down. He dropped some big scans on me. Um, I mean, they're constantly pushing forward. Let me get some more damage on my Stalkers here. I mean, Marines don't have a lot of health. Um, some of those Banshees still alive. Testament to, I guess, how effective they are. Um, currently. There we go. Boom, boom. Hmm. Okay. Oh, Sprinkles' mouse died. There we go. Let's get some DTs in here. Get some DTs with their blink slashes. There we go. 
Uh, I need the Shadow Fury. Give me that Shadow Fury. Got the Creeper Host coming in here. Boom. Boom. I think it's an inevitability. Uh, we're going to win, I think. I think. But I don't want to make any assumptions just yet. Uh, oh, wait. It's just Rainer now. Wait, what? Okay. I guess everybody left. Um, it's just Rainer. Just lots and lots of Rainer bio. Um, all right, I guess Rainer bio is being put to the test. Currently, it's still fragile, as I remember. Um, don't worry though, he's got more boys. I think his tanks are gonna start stacking up, and that might be the worrisome thing. Don't know if we can really push past all those tanks, because because Rainer tanks got a lot a lot of armor as well. Um, if they don't like get knocked out quickly. Ah! That guy make it? That guy didn't make it. Okay. I just need some more AoE. I think the Dehees will help. Help, uh, help with that. Abs, I think, are actually the solution. Um, they don't discriminate with their explosive baneling damage. Um. Oh my god, the bunker's getting sliced here. Uh huh. Rain and Marines getting pushed forward. Big explosion. It's got a few tanks left. Come on, boys. Okay. I think his uh, the left side here is pretty strong. Uh, woo! Yeah, those creeper hosts are, are doing a number. I'm gonna get some more DTs here. Oh, we're dropping infested doors. Let's go. He's finished. Also, like because like uh, there's only one person, he has less infested doors overall. So like he just has less of a chance overall. So I'm just gonna suck everything in here so that cigars wave can just pop it real nice, uh, or slightly nicer. Rainer Bow has never held up well against a big acid explosions. Um, there we go. This is just cyberbullying, really. Um, oh my goodness. Uh, oh, I actually dealt quite a bit of damage. Huh. Unexpected. Well, there we go. Let's take a look. Um, how do my DTs do? Probably those are just marine kills. Uh, okay. Stalker's doing better. Well, if you guys enjoyed these two games, be sure to leave a like, and until next time, I will see you guys later. The tires, let's light some fires! Need a light. They picked the wrong fights.